<laughs> Welcome to part two. Um, so if you guys watched the last one, you saw that two out of the seven and a half books that I opened in this Dresden set uh, did have a little bit of damage to them. Uh, crumpled corner or spine edge, whatever you'd call that. Um, it's not terrible, but it's very disappointing. Uh, we're going to open up this other package. Oh, by the way, time to vote. Uh, take a look at this one. This one, um, oh boy. Uh, yeah. I mean, go ahead and vote. <laughs> Whatever you think. God damn. See, the problem with this, okay, here's why there's damage to this package. If this package was filled to the brim with packing peanuts and nothing was moving in there, it would be much less likely to take a ding like that. Okay. The other problem with it is the packaging itself, the cardboard, there is thicker cardboard out, out there. Now, it's not that this is the thinnest I've ever seen. Okay, here's the other box, so I'll pull this up for you. It's not the thinnest I've ever seen, but this is on the same level as like those Amazon boxes that you get, and I don't ship books in those. I don't. I have an advantage, okay? So I work at a weight loss center. I get protein bars in these big, thick, you know, cardboard boxes that are yay big. I can like fill the whole damn thing with packing peanuts. And all. I, you know, I use that, okay? That's fine. Um, if you guys don't have access to that, you can go to Walmart and find it. Um, you know, if you have to spend the extra money, it's worth it for not having to deal with an insurance claim with your USPS or having to refund your buyer. Um, let's go ahead and open this one, though. I'm scared. I'm absolutely terrified. Because, um, as I was saying in the previous video, the money books are in this package. I need to find my center. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. This one has a lot of tape on it. Maybe it's the most expensive one. So I almost asked a dumb question, where do you get this eBay tape? I'm pretty sure I know where to get it. <laughs> I could really use it. It's all official looking. Alright, deadbeat. Okay. Nope, nothing. Okay, good. 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 Yes, number 32. Damn Skippy. <laughs> Okay, now this side of the package is the one I think got a little bit more damage to it. Aha! This would be, I believe, the most expensive one I got. I bought them as a set, so I mean, price is kind of relative, but... It's funny because when it came to quote time, he says, hey, I got these Dresden books. I say, great, what do you want for them? He says, I haven't actually sat down to figure out what I would ask for them. I haven't even considered selling them. And so I basically threw a quote at him and he says that his agrees with mine. So, okay. I think we did okay, guys. I think we're all right. I don't see anything that's jumping out at me. Now, this is an interesting set, though. So this, this number does not match. This is number 347. Okay, so it's not a full matching set. I'm missing books one and two anyway. I think I told you guys that at the beginning of the last uh, video. So I'm not too broken up about that. Um, you know, that is a relatively expensive one compared to, I mean, those goes for like maybe 300 bucks just for that one. Um, one of these in here though is kind of an oddball book. Um, and I'll have to show you what I mean by that. is this Chinese finger trap? Um, oh, okay. Maybe I ought to take off the big thing that says eBay on it. Oh yeah, there's two copies of side jobs. So, that happened. I told you I didn't want the actual one. 
And again, he gave it to me. I think he just wanted to be out. You know, it's like if, if he's got dress and stuff and he wants to sell it, he just wants to sell all of it. He says he gave it to me for free. Yeah, I'm inclined to agree with him. Okay, another side jobs. Um, I can't remember if the other one matched or not. Does this one match? This one does not. Number 730. Absolutely not. Okay. Now, is this the last book in here? I think it is. And this is the weird one. This is a very weird one, I think. Yeah, this is the weird one. So, pop this open. I mean, to his credit, I mean, he really did spend some time putting this together. Although, it was ready the day I bought them. So, must work from home. Okay. Alright. I'm scared to scratch at it. I don't want to vent anything beneath. There we go. Alright, so... This appears to be just a normal Dresden Limited. Um, put this. Alright, round tape, hang on. Alright. Cursory inspection, all is well. Um, here's why this is kind of goofy. This, my friends, is a lettered copy, but where's the letter? There is none. Um, I guess this is one of the overrun copies that either, so, well, not lettered. This is a limited. Or is it? Oh, no, no, it is lettered. The reason why, it's got like quasi leather. You see this kind of weird half leather book. I don't really know or understand this. There's no tray case. Um, you know, although the real letters did come with that. But yeah, I guess this is an overrun copy that was either, you know, given to somebody who knows a publisher or something. I don't know where this guy bought this from. I want to say he said he, um, he bought it from eBay. So there's that. Okay, so overall, I would say packaging. Oh boy, we have packaging about a about a B, maybe a B. A lot of them escaped the damage. The, those two down there. I'm gonna have to email him. He told me he was shitting bricks because I told him that I do these videos. I, I told him I wouldn't put it up if he didn't want me to. So there's a chance this video never sees the light of day. Um, but we'll have to take a look and see what he wants to do. He told me something about like in the event that there's a problem, he wants a full. He do a full refund and I send it back. I don't really think that I want to do that. It's just a couple little freaking dings, man. I can handle that. It's not perfect, but the set was never perfect anyway. We'll see what he wants to do. We'll see how bad he feels. See what he decides he wants to hand back to me, if anything. All right. Thanks, guys.